Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys, wherever you are in this beautiful world. Whenever you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. For the newcomers, my name is Didi. Uh, today, a short TA update in the morning, maybe later in the afternoon, again, a beautiful family video. I'm going to try to split them, like TA in the morning, family during the day, because else I don't have the time to record everything in the morning. It's not like in the rhythm here in Europe. So let's quickly jump into the first chart that I want to share with you guys. Bam, over here. This is the first chart, guys. This is the one hour chart. On the one hour chart, uh, you can see that the bam bam indicator here indicated long over there there was a lot of blue and yellow in the bottom so that's not a moment to take the long then when the green candle closes above the yellow stepping line that was uh, indicated purple triangle and you can see that the green is starting in the bottom as well so green hills which is bullish that's good for the bulls the white line starts to go upwards the blue line is above the white and this is a quadruple confirmation over there and that's the moment you take that trade that trade can lead up all the way up to here where you exit the trade so when you see this short signal that's a 2.5 and uh, 2.6% trade almost sometimes you can also decide to exit the trade when we close the candle down below the yellow stepping line here that would have made the same type of profit so yes two types of exit over there when this beautiful red uh, uh, short signal is there or when the candle closes down below the yellow step line over there that would have been the stop of the long or the sh start of the short guys that's how the bam bam indicator works if you want more information about the bam bam indicator uh, then go to the bitcoinfamily.com let's zoom out bam here the one day channel i've been drawing this line already for weeks on this channel i told you at the golden cross we are going to move up all the way up to the orange levels we hit all the targets and the next target would be where that yellow end uh, line ends over there that dotted white line 33k so yes we can pull back a little bit and come up again and pull back and come up but there should be that target the orange line should be the first support the green line the second support and the red line the third support so yes for me all bullish at the moment guys let's quickly jump into a few more charts that are very interesting for you guys to see at the moment that are bam this this is the first one and this chart is showing you um, the Bitcoin extreme oscillators and this is telling you when the bottom is there or when we are very bullish and when the top is there now check this chart if you look here every time when we uh, go negative like 28 percent 79 percent here 62 percent 61 percent 58 percent these are the moments that we are in the bear markets of bitcoin short-term bear markets or long-term bear markets these are the bear markets now we were in a huge bear market we are now our head is now coming above that black line over there the horizontal line which means look what happened every time when we start to uh, create these green squares 500 percent almost 100 percent almost 6400 percent 600 percent 2800 percent so yes there's an important indication that we are starting to get more and more bullish and bam that you can see also on this chart this chart shows you the bitcoin macro index there's a chart of willy who um, this macro index is indicating okay the moment that red line is uh, surpassing the bluish area over here that is the moment that reaccumulation is starting again here yes the investors are finding the bottom the bottom is found here the investors and we are talking about the big time investors the fundamental investors they understand that the bottom is in and they start to reaccumulate that is what they are doing and then when we will reach the top between the bluish line and that pinkish that will be the moment that they will start to sell again that is the distribution phase of them so now here for you should mean buying now and if we go to the next one that is this chart over here very interesting as well because we have talked many times about it uh, the cost based of short-term and long-term hodlers now the thing that you need to understand is every time when that red, red line the red line is a short-term cost basis the blue line is a long-term cost basis every time when that red line goes down below the blue line means that the short-term people the people that are buying bitcoin at that moment short-term people are buying the bitcoins cheaper than the long-term people every time when that red line goes below it the short-term people are buying the bitcoins cheaper than the long-term people's buying price and average so the moment that red line goes above it they are buying more expensive than the uh, long-term people now look what is happening here again they are coming above it again so the long-term people 
are buying bought cheaper than the short term people and that is a very bullish signal because check what happens every time when that happens and the red line crosses the blue line we see a huge bull market red line crosses the blue line we see a huge market bull market every time so yes we will see it happening here again these purple cups are the bear market bottoms bear market bottoms bear market bottoms this is the end of the huge bear market we are going to go more bullish 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 every day bam and why do you uh, and why should you invest in bitcoin and not keep your money on bank accounts uh, just very simple explanation because of this because if you invest in bitcoin you're investing in a technology that is the evolution of money that has a logarithmic growth yes this will be decreasing in growth all the way up to 21 million bitcoin this is how you create a monetary system that is sustainable all the other ones here, the fiat currencies, they have exponential growth, which means they just keep printing more and more and more, and they will grow, grow, grow. This is unsustainable. So this is impossible to create 20% new money every year or 5% new money every year. It's just not healthy. This is the only healthy monetary system that is decentralized, accessible, and non-corruptible for everyone in the world, guys. So that is why I strongly believe in Bitcoin. That was the short TA update video from today, guys. Um, I hope you bam, really enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy all the information, give the video a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification, leave a comment. What do you think about all the charts? And yes, also leave a comment. Do you like that I um, split the charting from the family videos? It's better, I think, for Google Analytics and all that stuff because then people that want to see charts can see charts and people that want to see family can see family and people that want to see both just need to watch both videos. Now, thanks for watching. See you tomorrow again or later today. Bam.